Over 400 wives of Massachusetts state police officers are participating in a campaign to cover the state with blue ribbons. The ribbons are being placed on trees and poles throughout the state to show support for law enforcement and their families. Molly Hanchett and Becky Canty were welcomed to bring the program into town and received help from the Hopkinton Police Department. All right, so we are here on behalf of the Massachusetts State Police Wives to support all of our local officers. We want to make sure that everyone knows they have support from all of us because right now in the world it's a little crazy and upsetting. So this when is they show see us these support. ribbons, we want them to know that we're thinking of you guys and that we're all behind you, the families, the local law enforcement, the state law enforcement, we're all a family here. So we just want you all to know that we're, we're backing you 110%. When you see these, think of the families, the friends, local law enforcement, we're all backing you. We certainly appreciate this. Uh, seems like every day now you turn on the news, you're reading about a, another tragic event in the newspaper about an officer fallen. Uh, obviously what happened in in, in, in Texas and other communities, it's, it's just surreal what's been going on with law enforcement and uh, in the news, a lot of protests against police. And uh, but we have good offices here in Hopkinton and all over the, the nation, and we just continue to keep your chin up and do your job that you uh, sworn to do. But it really leaves uh, a good feeling when we get support like this in uh, these tough times for police. And we really do. So we're supporting um, the Mass State Police, we're the wives of local police officers, and we just want everyone in their whole community to know that we're there to support all law enforcement. Yes, the Mass State Police wives has led the way, uh, hanging the blue ribbons, uh, but we want everyone to know that we're out there for you. So when you see these blue ribbons, we want you to know that we're thinking of you, we support you, we back you 100%. We're thinking of the family members, we're thinking of all the law enforcement, the Mass State Police community, as well as all the local, local law enforcement. So that's really our main goal here is to put up these ribbons. When people see them, know that you have a community supporting you. And we'd also like to encourage all local people to hang them on their trees and their front lawn to show their own support, know that then you know that there's people that have you back in town each town we're trying to get in every town in the state and so this way it shows the support knowing that the respect is still there and i understand you've done a number of towns already can you just talk about some of the towns you did and some of the towns you are going to do yep. i know there's towns in groton um, we're doing hopkinton tonight on monday um, i'll be leading the way for marlboro on thursday at 4 p.m um, sudbury will be short thereafter in the next couple of weeks and I'm waiting back to hear from Milford, and we're trying to get in Westboro. I know there's some other ones out west that have been um, done already. I don't know all the towns. I know they're still working on, like... Yeah, I think the Berkshires were yeah. covered. Uh, we're also going to try to get into Ashland as well. So, like she said, we are looking for other folks' support, even other wives of other departments, to come out to lead the way, putting more ribbons up. The more, the merrier, because, again, when you see them, you know that you're backed. So how did this Blue Ribbon program get started? Wives of um, one of the troopers has started the MSP Wives, and it was really for support initially for um, all the women, all the wives out there that their husbands are working midnights and getting those shifts so that no one's home when they have the newborn or there's a function on the weekend and you're left alone. So it really started as support for one another, and then all the tragedies started happening around the country, and we thought that it was a good way to show our support for other departments. Um, that we understand, we know what you've gone through, and really the blue ribbon came from the thin blue line of um, the police support. <laughs> yeah, we've kind of actually um, been in charge of getting our own ribbons. So we've had a great support from the Sunnyside Gardens in Hopkinton. Uh, Mary there actually made a bunch of ribbons, these ones that are hanging here, and donated them. So thank you again to Sunnyside. We really appreciate it. Uh, but all the other ribbons that you're seeing really are coming from the wives in the local communities. Where we found some good ways of uh, keeping a budget low. <laughs> so we'll, we purchase tablecloths, we cut them the long ways, uh, buy some mesh ribbons, and hang them up so it's all of your creative genes are welcome here I am not creative but the Mass State Police wives in the Facebook group have been showing us examples that we're following